Father, in the name of Jesus, we've come to you. Thank you, Father. Thank you that you reign above it all. Faithful. We thank you, Lord, and we bless you. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, we thank you. We are so grateful. In the name of Jesus, we give you praise, oh, God. We give you glory and honor. We thank you, Lord, and we bless your holy name this morning. You are Lord. God in Jesus We thank you this morning, oh God, that you reign above it all, oh God. We lift up your name. You reign over You reign over everything. I've come to worship your name, Father. Thank you, Lord. Bless you. Father, you're an awesome Father. Of come to worship. We say, have your way, O Lord. In the name of Jesus. Come to the name of Jesus. We thank you, Lord, that we serve an awesome God. One who's alive and rich and powerful and sharp in the name of Lord. We reign above it all, Father. We love you. We pray for this one. We thank you, Lord. We magnify your name, Lord. We thank you, Lord. Knowing that you're great, 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 you are Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Let us magnify your name, O Father. Lord, your name, Lord. Every family that is represented here. Yes, Lord. Trust that all of us will leave this place. Glory to your name, Jesus. Father, we declare and proclaim publicly that you have been faithful. You continue. You remain faithful. Thank you for being a God of covenants. Thank you, Lord. You are God. Thank you. You lead us in the way that we should go. God, you are always providing. our children in the way that we should go. So we thank you this morning. Thank you that we can wake up this morning. Never getting weary in love. Out your name in praise. Thank you, sir. Your heart is Made it unto you in the name of Jesus Christ. That's right. But we appreciate you. Praise and glory and honor. And we appreciate all that you have done on our Always see your goodness. We thank you this morning because you alone are God. Your faithfulness. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, Lord. Thank you. Lord. Have your way this morning. Hello, I pay your name. Lord, Gabriel, we bless you because you're a provider. It's everything that we need of you already provided. Jesus Christ. The Lord, we thank you for manifesting your presence and your power. In the name of Jesus Christ. As we, to be consistent. As we continue yeah, to allow the Holy Spirit to Just lead and guide us. You, Lord. In the name of Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Father. Bless your holy name, O God. Have your way, Holy Spirit. In the name of Jesus, God. We give you praise, glory, and honor. In the mighty name of Jesus. Hello, and be your name. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. This may we have our communion elements ready so we can share together. Yeah. I'll read to us from First Corinthians chapter 11 from verse 23 to 27. So the Apostle Paul says, For I passed unto you what I received from the Lord himself. On the night when he was betrayed, the Lord took some bread we take the bread below and gave thanks to God for it. Then he broke it in pieces and said, This is my body, which is given for you. Do this in remembrance of me. Amen. We thank the Lord for the bread in our hands. We've come to remember Jesus Christ. Thank you, Lord. Opportunity that we have. Let's pray. That we, have, we want to remember you, Lord. We say thank you for the privilege 
to be the ones who remember you often. We say, for as often as we do this, we do it in remembrance of you. So yes. we hold our hands with this representation of your body. And even as we break it, we are breaking it symbolically and prophetically. Yeah. It's how your body was broken, not your bones. This is how it was broken on the cross. Thank you, Lord. Mm -hmm. And we thank you because even as we study your words on different occasions, we trust that your words will be broken up to us, broken down to us so that we can receive it and digest it, so that our transformation will be sure through your word in yes, Jesus. Lord. Thank you for the grace to remember you in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Are we partake? Mm -hmm. It says, in the same way he took the cup of wine after supper, saying, this cup is a new covenant between God and his people, and I yes. confirmed with my blood. Do this in remembrance of me as often as you drink it. For every time you eat this bread and drink this cup, you are yes. at death until he comes. Amen. Let's stand yeah. together. Heavenly Father, we thank you for the cup. Thank you, Father. That's your holy name, oh God, for the cup. We are so grateful for what you have in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Father, for the cleansing of power in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Father. You praise him. That because of the blood of Jesus Christ, we were engrafted into you. We were able now to come home with Jesus all. The blood of the new covenant, the covenant of the time of need. Thank you for the blood of the covenant out on the mercy seat on our behalf in the name of Jesus. Thank you for your wisdom. Because of that, you saw it fits for the blood of Jesus. Thank you for the blood of Jesus. And I made you the blood of Jesus for the sacrifice that you have done. Thank you. Help you have in the name of Jesus, Father. Thank you. God, give you praise, glory, and honor this morning. We bless you for Lord in Jesus' name. Thank you. Thank you, Lord. Yes, Lord. We bless your name, Father. Amen. Amen. Glory to God. Thank you. Well, every time you eat this bread and drink this cup, you're announcing the Lord's death until it comes. So anyone who eats this bread or drinks this cup of the Lord unworthily is guilty of sinning against the body and blood of the Lord. Amen. Amen. We do not partake of it unworthily in Jesus' name. Amen. 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 I'd like for us to read Psalm 145 together, 21 verses, I think. So let's read it together. Will exalt you and come for the king and praise you forever. I'll praise you forever. Yes, I will praise you forever. Great is the Lord. No one can measure his greatness. Your mighty acts, each generation, is children of the I will meditate on your majesty and proclaim your power. I will meditate on your majesty and splendor and your wonders and wonderful miracles. You are all inspiring deeds. I will bring your grace. Everyone will cheer you. About all of your works, thank you for kingdom. In your fittingness, follow us to your grace and power. It's all about your mighty deeds. It's all about your majesty and glory. They will speak of the glory of your kingdom. They will give a glimpse of the power of your kingdom. They will tell about you throughout the world. Generations and glorious names, promises, and kingdom is the next generation. Gracious in all he does, 
Open your eyes and all look to you in the home. You give them the their food as they need it. You build your kindness. You satisfy the hunger and thirst of every living thing. Lord is righteous in everything. He doeth. Lord, he fills the of those who fear him. Lord is close to all who call on him. He has to all who call on him in truth. Praise the Lord. He grants the desire of those who fear him. He cries for help and rescue them. God protect all those who love him, but he destroys the wicked. Praise the Lord. And may everyone on the earth bless his holy name forever and ever. Amen. Yeah. So on that note, may we praise the Lord. Amen. Let's worship and praise Him. Yes. And Father, we worship and praise Thee. Oh, Father, you are the next. We extol you, O oh God, our King. Thank you, Lord. We praise Your name forever and ever. We glorify You forever and ever. Your name is great in the earth. Thank you, Lord Jesus Christ. Lord, you're most worthy to be praised. No one can measure, measure your greatness. In the name of Jesus Christ, from one generation to another, let us eat each generation to praise you, O God, for who you are. Thank you for your body and that your word is Thank you, Lord. We proclaim your power in the earth. In the name of Jesus Thank you, Thank you, Lord. And bless you, the holy name. We give you glory as we proclaim your power in the name of Jesus Christ, the majestic power. Glory to God, you are mighty and glorious and splendor. It's wonderful. As we meditate on your goodness, we give you praise and glory. We all give you glory. Your deeds are inspiring. With every job you will rise up, or you bless your I thank you for the and every person on the platform. We bless you for your unfailing love in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. You shower us with compassion because we are your creation in the name of Jesus Christ. We give you to this Lord as we say thank you, Father. Father, we say thank you, God. And even as I thank you for your power, which is great in the name of Jesus Christ. Your omnipotence, O Father, of your glory and of your kingdom. And your as we thank you, say that your kingdom is an everlasting kingdom and you rule the world for all generations. God, we give you praise and glory and honor for your kingdom. This is an everlasting kingdom which reigns for eternity. Thank you, Father, for your name of Jesus Christ. Help those who fall. Lord, we thank you for keeping our promises. That you have promised unto us, oh, gracious, O oh God, and you help those who bow down in the name of Jesus Christ. Help those who have been fallen in Jesus name. And so, God, we thank you and we praise you that you are Jehovah. Tama, you never leave us from the sake of your right hand with us. We give you praise, O God, to provide all that we have needed because of you. Thank you in every way that we in the name of Jesus Christ. When we're hungry. 
you satisfy our souls? Yes, and that is bless your God, how gracious are you forever and ever and ever. Thank you because you're righteous, the Lord. We thank you that you're close to all those who call upon you. We know that you're close to us because we call upon you, God. You grant the desire of our hearts, God. Especially those who reference you in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Protect us and we thank you for protecting us. Protecting the whole those you love. Jesus Christ of God and you destroy the wicked those who come against us. In the name of Jesus Christ. Oh Father, we thank you and we praise your God. For your divine protection, we hide continuously in the shadow of the Almighty, in the name of Jesus Christ. And we give you praise and thank you, Lord, that everyone on the earth that belongs to you is blessed in the name of Jesus Christ. And we will live forever and ever. In the name of Jesus, we give you praise and glory and honor. We bless you now. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Thank you, Lord. Glory to God. That's your name, God. Hallelujah, Jesus. Jesus name. Amen. Amen. Father. So, beloved, this book, we, will, uh, we are we're using this book to pray. I hope everybody has their copy. And I'll be using the Kindle version to lead us in prayer this morning. Um. So we're doing the second prayer. Every week we do one of them. Last week we did that of premature death, or putting the evil altar of premature death. We encourage everyone to be part of this every week as much as you can. Amen. So uprooting the altar of stagnation, I'm going to read a few pages here and then we'll get into prayer. The Lord our God spoke to us at Horeb, saying, you have stayed long enough on this mountain. Turn and resume your journey and go to the hill country of the Amorites and to all their neighbors in the Araba, in the hill country and in the lowland, the Shephala, in the Negev, south country, and on the coast of the Mediterranean Sea, the land of the Canaanites and Lebanon, as far as the great river, the river Euphrates. Look, I have set the land before you. Go in and take possession of the land which the Lord swore solemnly promise to your fathers, to Abraham, to Isaac, and to Jacob, to give to them and to their descendants after them. So this is Deuteronomy uh, chapter 1, verse 6 to 8. God is a God of movement. Amen. He's a God of movement. Everywhere we see God in the Bible, he is moving and never static. It's mm -hmm. no when any living thing starts to die, its mobility is one of the first things to go. Mm -hmm. Most importantly, as believers, we are designed to flow and go from glory to glory, according to 2 Corinthians 3.18. And we all, with unveiled face, continually seeing as in a mirror the glory of the Lord, are progressively being transformed into his image from one degree of glory to even more glory, which comes from the Lord, who is the Spirit. Mm -hmm. In Deuteronomy 1, 6 to 8, which we read prior, God rebuked the people of Israel for wasting their time going around the same mountain. Oh. Bring a bell with you. Or does it remind you of someone you know who has been stuck at the same place for the longest time? Oh. See, that importance of movement in a person's life that leads to progress, success, and a better life, especially when you have a calling from God to reach the masses. Unfortunately, I've met too many of God's people who love Jesus, but are desperately stuck. Everything is stagnant in their life. They just can't seem to get ahead. The truth of the matter is that they are victims of a vicious evil altar, known as the altar of stagnation. Thankfully, this evil altar can be destroyed in the courts of heaven. Amen. Amen. We're going to begin with a prayer of attention. But I would like to add here that uh, my observation in this work is that those who are stuck by this evil order of stagnation, first, I, I want to say very loosely, but this is my observation, that this, this um, spirit is transferable. People who are stuck want to get you entangled and get you stuck as well. It's been my observation. I don't know about you. 
So let's Amen. be careful. Stock people want to make others stock, consciously or unconsciously. They just want to get you in the same position, but you have to find a way of escape. Otherwise, you become a victim of their cycle. Amen. So we choose not Amen. to be in Jesus' name. Amen. And so prayer of activation. So we'll pray together. So this is it. Let's address the Father in worship. We began already, so let's continue. Heavenly Father, Heavenly Father we open your name, name and greatly be praised. I worship and adore you. Your kingdom and 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 your Righteous Church, Heavenly Father, righteous Church, I ask that the Lord send us more than one day to the world, send us more than one day to the world, send us more than one day to the world, I ask this in the mighty name of the Lord, I kept looking at the ancient of the Lord, I kept looking at the ancient of the Lord, I kept looking at the ancient of the Lord, I kept looking at the ancient of the Lord, I kept looking at the ancient of the Lord, I kept looking at the ancient of the Lord, I kept looking at the ancient of the Lord, I kept looking at the ancient of the Lord, I kept your wheels were burning fire, 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 Glory to God. And in your royal court, and in the royal court of the blood, of the finished work of the finished work of the blood, I have come to receive the righteous, I have come to receive the righteous, and all 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 the Righteousness and the declaration of that evil altar of salvation. I decree and declare that this evil altar of salvation will no longer arrest my progress or that my family members, neither will it hinder my ability to excel in right business in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. I pray. I surrender your rights to surrender your rights to self-presentation to the Lord as your advocate. Heavenly Father, your word in the first John 2 will want to present my little children these things I've written to you. Heavenly Father, your word in the first John 2 out from the So that you may not see and so that you may not see, we have an advocate in the heaven of Jesus Christ. The righteous Jesus Christ is the righteous. And he himself is the creation of us. Not for us, not for us, but for the whole world. I thank you that Jesus is my righteous judge. I pray for the righteous judge in the heaven. Jesus, I have the right to surrender to the representation of Jesus. 
Thank you, Father, that we will be able to judge the situations in the name of Jesus Christ. Thank you, Lord. Glory to your name, Jesus. Can we not handle small things among us in the name of Jesus Christ? Heavenly Father, I know that until the end of the things Never to break it, 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 break
oh God, we give you praise. Thank you, Father. Thank you for dealing with this group of that nation. Thank you for dealing with the enemy as he comes to make a decision. In the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth against us, we give you praise, glory, and honor, oh God, to bless you, oh Father. Even as it's covered under the blood that Jesus Christ is in us, on our behalf, in the name of Jesus Christ, is crying out on the mercy of in the name of Jesus Christ. Hear this cry of the blood of Jesus. Oh God, see the blood, see what Christ has done. Oh God, and we bless you and we glorify you. Oh God, return. Come to turn quickly. Glory to God. Thank you. Earliest opportunity. As the law will, how you are my personal in the way. Where is that? It's not so much to go over to the judge and judge to the garden and the Lord and all the nations. Heavenly Father, in all humility, while renouncing the spirit of the Lord, I just quickly agree to the legal accusation of the adversary. I should deny the righteous judge. Every accusation to the Satan is because of and my blood and even so oh God as I repent in the name of Jesus thank you Lord in the name of Jesus even those things that I've done in the name of Jesus Christ may be true they are still not at the end of the matter in the name of Jesus Christ your judgment your righteousness is the end of the matter your Father, we give you praise and glory and honor that the blood of Jesus in Nazareth seal it up, glory to God. And your, the blood of Jesus Christ brought us to a place, oh God, that we can expect the verdict of not guilty in Jesus' name. Father, we give you praise. We give you glory and honor that the victory belongs to Jesus Christ. Death, burial, and resurrection, and he is finished with work on the cross in the name of Jesus Christ. So we give you praise, glory, and honor. Yes, it's a fact that we're guilty, not true, in the name of Jesus Christ, because your word is true, O oh God, and what Christ has done on the cross, so we give you praise, and we give you glory and honor, in the name of Jesus Christ, the accusation, O oh God, has been not void in the name of Jesus Christ, and we give you praise. In Jesus' mighty name. Thank you, Lord, for revoking the demonic covenant and evil, and an evil altar in Jesus' mighty name. Heavenly Father, in my heartfelt desire to devote myself now from the spirit in the altar of stagnation, now, in the name of Jesus, I give back everything, anything that did say came from his kingdom. Up in the name of Jesus Christ, everything that I have, everything that I pursue, in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, that came from the place of and an evil altar and an evil desire, I return it and release it now. In the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, I only want the blood of Jesus Christ and secure for me in the name of Jesus Christ and my bloodline in the name. I thank you, Lord. There's nothing in my home, nothing, my life, nothing, no finances, no tangible assets. In the name of Jesus, I possess the seed from the enemy now. I curse it with the earth as I return to the enemy. In the name of Jesus Christ, I thank the Lord that the seed is from Jesus Christ. Go even now, and the angels of and if you find anything from the enemy, anything in the name of Jesus Christ, reveal it to me, O God, that I may lay it down in the name of Jesus Christ. And I pray that you consume it with your consuming fire now in Jesus' name. Father, we give you praise, Lord Jesus. Thank you for the 
hide in me and my house by your by the blood. So Satan has no legal foothold against me and my house in your courtroom in Jesus' name. It is written in First John one and nine. Glory to God. If we could and admit that we have sinned and confess our sins, the just will give us of our sins and cleanse us of all unrighteousness and will forgive our sins, O God. Thank you, Thank Father you, God. Everything that is in conformity with His will and purpose, righteous judge, we appeal to everything that the blood of Jesus has about all shortcomings, and in in the name of Jesus Christ. I pray, I receive by faith the cleansing power of the blood of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Thank you, Lord. I ask you, Father, to dismiss all of Satan's accusations and charges against me in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Father God, I appeal to the court of heaven this morning in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth that the blood of Jesus Christ can be me and the accusation in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Nothing that the enemy has accused me of. I am not guilty in the name of Jesus Christ according to the court, according to the in the name of Jesus Christ. I am the righteousness of God, but you see that the accuser of the prayer in the name of Jesus Christ, and I give you praise, O God. I thank you, Father, that I can destroy every evil and every evil accusation in your court in the name of Jesus Christ. Heaven is based on Jesus Christ. My heart turned I now come on the court of heaven to dismiss all Satan accusations and charges against. Me and my oh, blood right in Jesus' name. Or it is that the accuser of the brethren have been cast down in the name of Jesus. So I ask my father to cast down all Satan accusations against me in Jesus' name. Glory to God. Father, thank you, Lord. The cause to excel in destroy every evil altar, Father, and, and execute the evil altar against it in the name of Jesus. Heaven is the Satan planted in the judgment of your Supreme Court and destroyed evil altars of stagnation and the idol that sits in all of you that Satan planted in my bloodline in Jesus' name. By the spirit of prophecy and prophecy, the truth and truth, profess the complete destruction of the evil altar and sacrifice in his life in Jesus' name. For it is written in Psalms 91 11 to 12, for he will command his angels in charge of you to protect and defend and guard you in all your ways. Obedient and thirsty, they will lift you up in their hands so that you do not strike your foot against the stone. I receive angelic assistance right now in the mighty name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Lord, thank you, Father. Father, we thank you for your praise, O God. Let your holy name for the angels, O God, rank high ranking angels. Officers in yeah, heaven that will hold forth and fight and on my behalf. Oh God, deal with the spirit of stagnation in the name of Jesus Christ. And so, God, we give you praise and glory and Thank honor. you, Father, for this angels that are working on my behalf now in the Thank name you, Lord. of Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Heavenly Father. Heavenly Father, I present before you your Supreme Court of Fathers and Peter as my Father, I present evidence against the Supreme Court and the Office of Stagnation in my life. The righteous will serve in my days. Long live upright and righteous. They will grow like a cedar on the Lebanon, majestic and stable according to Psalms 92 and 12. 
Righteous and will be like the tree, only planted and useful by stream of the water. In Lebanon, majestic and beautiful, and you will be like a tree. If we will not wither and whatever streams of water yields its fruit, if it does not wither, and in whatever it does, it prospers. And clear that the spirit is of the and the altar of stagnation allowed to succeed and Thank you, Lord. 
document of the court. So thank you, Father. And ask that you seal your righteous verdict against the spirit and the ultimate vaccination in the precious blood of Jesus Christ. May you also cover with the blood of Jesus all my legal proceedings in the name of Jesus Christ. I decree and declare the righteous verdict of release and breakthrough from every every evil altar in my life and the life of my generation and the generation in the future. This of stagnation is now secured in the documents of the courts of heaven. For it is written in the gospel, chapter 8, verse 36. So if the son is free, then you are unquestionably free in me. I decree and declare that I am free, and my bloodline is free of the evil altar of stagnation. In the mighty name of Jesus, we pray, Lord. We bless the holy name this morning. We bless the holy name, O God. Freedom in every area of my life and the life of my bloodline and generation in the future. In the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, God, we give you praise and glory and honor, Lord. Have your divine way in the name of Jesus Christ. As you have set up our things, oh God, as we brought it before you in the name of Jesus Christ, thank you, Lord, that the blood of Jesus Christ, oh God, judge the situation in the name of Jesus. Thank you that your word judged my name. In the name of Jesus Christ, thank you that you are a righteous judge, and you are a judge that will glory to God when you are in this position. It is well made, so I give you praise this morning. I bless your holy name this morning, that my life is no more stagnant. In the name of Jesus, in the life of my family and my bloodline, and now going to ten generations in the future, no mistake can be found. Bless your holy name now. In the name of Jesus Christ. Thank you, Father, that the spirit of that nation loose me now in the name, name of Jesus Christ. You will go out and go now in the name of Jesus Christ. And you will not return to this house in the name of Jesus. This temple that was made without hands. Lose your holy name now in the name of Jesus. the first has been who have lost your, your, your reign in the name of Jesus Christ cannot remain blood of Jesus is against you loose me in the name of Jesus Christ loose me now in Jesus loose me right now in the name of Jesus the blood of Jesus Christ of Nazareth is against the spirit of stagnation so I command you now from the very root that you come up come out and loose and go now in Jesus' name. God, we give you praise and we bless you. We glorify you in the mighty name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. And we thank you, Father. Bless your holy name for the burden. In Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Uh, Revelations 22 from verse 1. Thank you, Lord. As we share our greetings this morning. And the angel showed me a river with the water of life, clear as yes. flowing from the throne of God and of the Lamb. It flowed down the center of the main streets. On each side of the river grew a tree of life, bearing 12 crops of fruit, with a fresh crop each month. The leaves were used for medicine to heal the nations. No longer would a curse upon anything for the throne of God and of the Lamb will be there, and his servants will worship him, and they will see his face, and his name will be written on their foreheads, 
and there will be no night there, no need for lamps or sun. For the Lord God will shine on them and they will reign forever and ever. Amen. 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 Here, the, the, every verse is a verse of emphasis, but um, verse 2, it says, it, this. first of all, this Revelation 22 is telling us about the restoration of Eden, how Eden is has been restored and how it's supposed to function. Amen. Now it's Lord verse 2 says it that water it flowed down the center of the main street on each side of the river grew a tree of life. It says bearing 12 crops of fruits with a fresh crop each month. In other words, it's telling us that our fruitfulness is supposed to be monthly, continuous, basically. Amen. Not that we fruitful in January, then stagnant in February, then fruitful in April, then stagnant again, and then fruitful. It's supposed to be an every month thing, an every time thing. Amen. Amen. So we thank God for thank this. You, Lord. Continue to pray um, throughout the day and throughout the week on this particular subject matter and declaring our victory in Jesus' name. May we share greetings. May the grace of our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ, the love, love of God, God, and the fellowship of the Holy Spirit, Holy Spirit. Holy Spirit. Holy Spirit. Holy Spirit. Holy now be with us now and forever. Holy God, for the Lord's and for the Lord's all the days of our lives, and we will dwell in the house of the Lord forever and ever. Amen. 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 Have a blessed day, family. Thank you. God bless you. Amen. Amen.